Hello everyone, my name is Adele and welcome to Toadstool House Art. So I realise it's been a while, it's been a few weeks since my last vlog went up um, and there is a reason for that uh, but I'll, I'll get to it at the end, it's a bit long. Um, but yeah, so this vlog is mainly going to be, um, I took a bunch of footage before Christmas uh, that didn't make it into the last vlog so it's going to be in this one uh, and it's basically just sort of my last uh, sublimating session before Christmas because um, I had a few bits I wanted to do uh, that I found in a box that I hadn't done and um, I did some last minute Christmas presents so yeah so you're gonna get to see me uh, sort of print that uh, and I have some footage of my cats because <laughs> of course I do um, but yeah if, thank you for coming back thank you for waiting I know it's been a couple of weeks now um, but yeah so We'll start off with the uh, the supplementing part. <laughs> Hey, it's finally stopped raining so I can actually talk about uh, what I'm actually doing without being drowned out by the noise of the rain. So yeah, I am doing some sublimating, just the last bit of printing because this press in the printer and everything else is going to go away over Christmas basically because this is <laughs> this is the dining room table so uh, <laughs> you know we kind of need that for Christmas dinner so I need to pack everything up 
Um, and so I've orders on my Etsy have kind of dried up now, which, you know, I'm like a couple of days before Christmas, I've fully expected to happen. And I don't really want to be printing anything, you know, <laughs> on Christmas. So any orders that I get for anything that's printed will be going out uh, afterwards. So what I've been doing is I printed this little bandana. So this is for Milo and there he is. Uh, that's my brother's dog. Um, and it's, it's their first dog that they've ever had. So... <laughs> So yeah, I'm making presents for a dog. Well, this one's really for them. And these are so cool. I got a few of these. Um, they're quite weighty and you get them in silver and I ended up getting just the gold ones to try because I've never done them on these before. And these are cool because they're double sided so you can put a picture on each side. So I decided to go with two different ones. So that's the one where he, that was his first um, from the groomers, the first time he was groomed. And that's just one of him in his bed. So yeah. So yeah, uh, I'm also doing another one that I got this other style as well. This one is also heavy, so I hope it's going to be alright on the tree. So this one is like a, a Polaroid photo style frame, I guess. Uh, but it says Joy on it. And uh, uh, my mum sent me over a picture of all the kids and uh, holding Milo, so I'm going to do that one for them. Um, and I found in a bag... Uh, a bunch of these, like, leftovers that I hadn't printed on. Some key rings. Those are badges. Um, so I'm printing out some more frogs. Um, basically, ju they're just to go in these. Um, so I'm just working out sort of what designs I need more of. So, yeah, because all these are going to go up in my shop for January. I'm planning on having a big update where everything that's not what that I've got in stock but not up on the shop will <laughs> actually be up on the shop, finally. Um, so yeah, so then I'll be able to put these froggies up finally because I just they've just been sat here not doing anything because I just haven't had the time or the sort of drive to do it because you know putting things on Etsy takes forever. So I'm just gonna print a, a few more of each and <laughs> yeah, one more thing. Uh, another thing for Milo, it's gonna be quite spoiled, and this wasn't my idea by the way. So I've got this, and this is I can't even get it all in. Um, it's a Santa sack, basically. It's a present sack. And my mum, again, not my idea, has requested that I put Milo's name on it. You know, the dog. No, not any of the kids. No, 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 no. Wants a, a sack for the dog. <laughs> for his present. She's bought, she's bought the dog present. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. Uh, I just did those two coasters. Those were for... Uh, a couple of Christmas gifts. Um, there was someone at work, so I've already I've already taken those and wrapped those up. Uh, so yeah, just need to do the ornament, the sack, and all my little badges and keyrings, and then yeah, go tidy up for Christmas. But this came out really nice. Um, yeah, it's, it's it's just it's quite a thin piece of fabric, really, but you know it's printed really well. Looks really crisp and clear. So yeah, oh, and I have um. I also got some of these as well, but they're, they're much smaller than the other ones. So you can see the circle inside, you only get a, a very small picture. So I don't know if if people were interested, I would definitely sell these uh, next year. But obviously <laughs> I'd be doing this a lot sooner before Christmas. So yeah, oh, and these, I got these um, hearts by accident. I meant to buy more of these MDF ones. Because uh, I like these, because these, they're, they're nice and chunky. Um, but I accidentally bought these sort of plastic ones. Um, they will get used, I just don't know what I'll use them for. Um, probably presents. <laughs> so yeah, gonna finish off my last bits of printing and then I can tidy up.
them all done. Those are the badges. Uh, I did all the curings. I uh, got all them done. I just need to uh, put the, the little loops on. Uh, but I'm probably just going to leave that till tomorrow. Um, it's getting a little late. Um, oh, and I need to pop the, the badge backs onto these. But yeah, I'll do that. I'll do that tomorrow because I just have one more thing to do. And that is the uh, the big Santa sack. So for Milo. So I've got it printed out. Obviously, it's, you know, backwards. So I'm just going to cut the extra bit of paper off at the bottom here and uh, see if this fits. So I did it and it's worked and it looks really, really nice. I mean, it looks pretty crisp around the edges and the red matches really well with the red of the background. It's it's only slightly different, but it, it's kind of got this stripe going down. So it, it's, you know, it fits in with it. So yeah, <laughs> made a Santa sack for a dog. <laughs> Got him, yeah. And then there's his bandana and the ornament that I'm going to give to my brother. So yeah, this dog is so spoiled already. Not even a year old. <laughs> right, well, that's about it for me for tonight. So I'm going to uh, pack everything away. Well, most of it. I'm going to, I'm going to leave the press just to sort of sat there to cool. Because uh, it takes a long time to cool down. And then, yeah, that's, that's all my printing for this year done.
so that's really everything that I wanted to uh, include in this vlog as you can see I'm it's 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 the same day for me because I'm this vlog is just pretty much everything that I wasn't able to do just all put together in this one uh, because right after Christmas I did get COVID um, and you know so that wasn't very fun so so I was you know out of commission for a few days uh, 11 days actually I did a full 11 day quarantine just to be absolutely sure that I couldn't you know pass it on to anyone else um, I'm all negative now though everything's fine um, and nobody else in my family got it nobody else in my house anyway got it um, so yeah <laughs> that wasn't much fun but um, I as far as I can tell I, I had it easy compared to other people because I was talking about it with some friends um, and like, I didn't have any of the classic symptoms. I didn't have a fever. Uh, I had a little bit of a cough. Um, but yeah, mostly just feeling unwell. Um, and yeah, I, I felt worse, honestly. I've had worse colds than what that was. And it didn't, it didn't last very long. It was just, uh, afterwards I was quite tired. So I spent 11 days, well, on the last day I did actually get dressed, but for like 10 days it was just pajamas every day all day because I mean what was the point because <laughs> uh, I was basically just going between my room and the bathroom <laughs> that was that was it so yeah a bit boring actually uh, I just you know watched a lot of Netflix because I couldn't really um, for a long time I just couldn't really concentrate on anything I was just you know too tired I did a little bit of drawing on my iPad but I never really you know it was really hard to concentrate when you're sort of that kind of tired I don't know but it's all over now and I've not had sort of any lingering effects but I did catch it like right after Christmas <laughs> so you know I was out of commission through um, like uh, New Year and everything so I missed all that I heard the fireworks though um, <laughs> and I was on a, a video call with some friends and they were outside and they were trying to catch some fireworks for me but it really wasn't working um, so, but that's alright. I don't, I don't normally do things for New Year, but like if, if there's like fireworks near, nearby, I will like open, open the curtains and watch them and things. Uh, so yeah, a bit of a, a mishmash vlog, I know. Um, but I do have like lots of plans for what I want to do. Um, uh, and I've got, um, things for my shop because obviously my shop, I couldn't run that. So, but Luckily, I didn't. I didn't have to close it because my mum offered to to basically packing and post for me because I I didn't want to touch anything, obviously. So I was just like, "There's there's the boxes, there's the envelopes. You just <laughs> here's here's my Etsy password. Off you go." <laughs> um, so yeah. So if you ordered off me um, any time, sort of like in the past two weeks, sorry you didn't get like a, a handwritten thank you note in like I normally do but I just I wasn't going to be touching anything of my stock at all so you know because I didn't want to accidentally uh, send someone an envelope of germs you know so yeah but now I can get back to that because I was going to have a, like a, a January update and like I just that sort of hasn't worked out at all um but the i've got things now that i just need to piece together like i've got new uh well more of the same designs i've got more key rings and more badges they just need put in together now um so i can finish updating the numbers on etsy but everything is in stock apart from the coasters i still need to get more coasters that was weird that there's like a national shortage on coasters there for a couple of weeks but um they have restocked and I am going to do a, a big order so I don't have to, you know, keep buying uh, so many. Because the place I order from, uh, if you spend so much, you do get free delivery. So it's better to just do, you know, a big order every once in a while than it is to do small orders and things. So, yeah, got all of those to put together. But that that's for the, the next vlog and everything. So including those those keyrings you've just watched me do, I haven't I haven't put the, the rings on yet. They're still, <laughs> they are still sat on my desk um but yeah i, I realized um for last year i did 30 vlogs last year uh which i think is pretty good um considering i only started in september august or september somewhere around there because i yeah i'm not surprised that it was it was at like two per week and then i cut it down to one um i still 
I'm going to carry on with once a week. Uh, that's just a lot easier for me. Um, I have new products that I want to be designing. So there are going to be some more watercolour illustrations coming your way. That you'll get to see in a couple of weeks um, for various things. So yeah, <laughs> uh, i got big plans and I just sort of need to get, you know, a bit more organised because that's what I was going to do between Christmas and New Year. And of course I was ill between Christmas and New Year, so I couldn't really do any of that. But I say, I'm absolutely fine now. No one else got it from me. You know, I just like a horrible little hermit just in my room <laughs> just for 11 days. So yeah, I've had to, um, I do what I call the purge, which is whenever I've been sick, like everything gets washed, like my bedding, um, still need to wash my dressing gown, but like oh, e everything that I touched and worn has been cleaned now, <laughs> even though it's probably like fine. I'm probably being a bit paranoid, but ugh, gems. Um, so yeah, I think that's it for today. Thank you for coming back. I know this is probably just a weird mishmash of stuff in this one. Uh, but yeah, more things to come. And yeah, I will see you next time. Bye.